Hey guys, thanks for dropping in for another Diecast and Diecast review. Looking at Kevin Harvick's 2001 Reese's Fast Break Good Wrench Chevy Monte Carlo. This was produced in 2002, and so it come it came in a 2002 box. Um, as you can see here, Kevin Harvick number 29 Jeep Good Wrench Reese's Fast Break 2002 Monte Carlo. It says, but this is actually the 20. Uh, 2001 uh, season he ran this paint scheme. One of 3,504. That's a pretty rare run, or a pretty rare, this is a fairly rare die cast. Um, for that time, 3,500 was not very many. Uh, back then, they would do runs of between 25,000 and 50,000 cars was no big deal back then. 3,500 is quite a few today, but um, back then, not very many. So uh, this one's been tough to find. I uh, have been watching um, eBay and other places. Was going to make a custom and actually found this. Uh, Diecast Depot had this. Uh, they had it marked down because the box does not have a sleeve on it, which kind of sucks. But um, for the price I got it for, uh, it was it was well worth getting this thing. So um, we got Reese's Fast Break on the, the uh, hood. Uh, number 29 on the right front headlight, RCR on the left front headlight, Monte Carlo, the uh, stainless steel looking grill at the bottom of these always looks good. Uh, we got uh, NASCAR contingency sponsors on the front nose, Goodyear over the front wheel wells, uh, front side of the door has the contingency sponsors as well, as well as the NASCAR race car logo on the A pillar. Uh, big blue 29 on the door. And we've got uh, the Dale Earnhardt Tribute number three at the top of the door. Uh, Kevin Harvick on the name rail. We got Coca Cola, Hershey's, uh, Van Camp's Beans, uh, Bass Pro Shops, and Tracker Boats on the B pillar. C pillar's got AC Delco and Team Realtree. Uh, Good Wrench Service Plus on the left rear quarter panel. And Snap On, Purdue, and Oreo in front of the left rear wheel well. On the lower left rear quarter panel, we got Sonic and the. Uh, we care uh, that logo that everybody ran uh, in the late 90s, early 2000s on the, uh, the rear bumper side there. So um, <clears throat> the rear tailpiece, we got Reese's Fast Break. And the reason I said this is a 2001 paint scheme is because of the rookie stripes. Uh, we got America Online and 29 on the taillights. Uh, deck lids got GM Performance Parts and... Got a big 29 on the roof there in blue. Uh, right side of the car is going to be basically the same as the left. Um, I don't know exactly when, I don't know when this paint scheme was ran. Um, but uh, like I say, it is pretty rare. Um, I was glad to get a hold of one of them. Been watching for one and uh, kind of wanted to uh, showcase this as soon as I got it. Uh, along with the uh, rest of the Kevin Harvick diecast reviews I'm doing this year to uh, kind of commemorate uh, his uh, long tenure in the Cup Series. So uh, we got GM Goodwrench Service Plus under the hood, and big blue spoiler on this looks really cool. Uh, fuel cell detail there, and we got a black uh, chassis, underbody, whatever you want to call it, um, and uh, full, uh, well not full, but lots of engine detail. This is an ARC, this isn't an Elite, but uh, still, like we've said before, like I've said before, tons of detail on the ARCs back in the day, uh, equivalent or more so than even the elites today. So anyway, that's all I got on this one. Uh, for some reason, the camera doesn't want to focus, but, um, we will, uh, we'll keep bringing the Kevin Harvick stuff to you as I get some more stuff in here. Uh, still have a lot of my collection to take a look at, but, uh, anyway, thanks for stopping in guys. We'll catch you on the next one.